Hello, good morning. Good morning, everyone. I hope you managed to follow the live gala virtual event on Facebook. Um, my name is Antani Ivanova. I'm the regional coordinator of the Balkan Green Ideas. I welcome everyone who are now following us on live on Facebook. This was the challenging weekend and very exciting morning when we will actually announce the winners of the Green Ideas uh, 2020. Uh, the last week, uh, we had the competition where 21 uh, Green Ideas in two lots have been pitching for uh, our event and the international jurors have a very tough job to um, select the best five winners in two lots for our best green ideas 2020. Um, for this event, I would like to invite, we are on separate location, uh, the Balkan Green Foundation as the organizers, together with the seven national foundations in different countries and support of the Rockefeller Brothers Fund. I would like to invite Mr. Visar Azemi, the executive director of the Balkan Green Foundation for a short introduction. And then we follow the announcement of the winners of the first lot, Green Ideas Concept. Welcome Visar, take your floor. Thank you very much, Antoineta. Thank you for the, all the hard work that you have done uh, with all the national foundations, the uh, jury members, uh, and bringing together this uh, uh, event again, despite the fact that uh, we had or we have been forced to organize it uh, virtually, not physically, as all of us have wished for. But uh, this was um, a different year, a tough year for all of us uh, in many aspects. Uh, with the pandemic, uh, you know, lots of things have changed and uh, lots of uh, ideas and uh, works have been shifted towards the virtual uh, platforms. Thanks to Zoom, we were able to organize it again and, um, uh, you know, with two very extensive uh, days of uh, pitchings and ideas and questions and answers by jurors. So uh, at the end, we're here um, not together, but together in spirit and uh, virtually, I would say. So uh, I want to thank also the National Foundations for all the hard work they have done uh, with uh, the ideas and the concept that they have pulled together. In the last uh, months, you know, this, um, I know you have uh, been hearing a lot from Antoineta with emails and Skypes and everything to prepare this. So uh, it wasn't easy for you as well. And we, we acknowledge that and we really applaud for all the hard work that you have done. Uh, thank you also to the jurors. Uh, we, uh, you know, we were able to bring good jurors this year. Some of them, you know, were with us in the previous year, some of them were brand new to, to the idea and the Balkan uh, Green Ideas uh, event and platform. So I'm uh, pretty sure this was an exciting moment for them as well to, to hear and, and listen and learn and everything else, but also to provide feedback to uh, the participants who have uh, you know presented their ideas uh, in front of you. Thank you also to the Rockefeller Brothers Fund for their continued support to Balkan Green Ideas and to you as national foundations of uh, you know to organize this uh, wonderful event and uh, to make it happen again i really hope that we will return physically uh, next year after we overcome these uh, obstacles with the pandemic and i uh, hope to be with you guys together next year again in belgrade hopefully as uh, it was planned this year uh, without any further ado, as uh, Antoineta has assigned me the role of announcing the winners uh, again this year, um, we uh, were supposed to um, divide some responsibilities with Mia Vukojevic, our program director for the Western Balkans at the Rockefeller Brothers Fund, but uh, it was uh, not quite possible. So I will continue with the announcement of winners for the Green Ideas concept lot. So here I would uh, like to uh, present the first one, uh, which is uh, Dominiki Vajati um, with the Balkan Green Concept Idea 2020 and the Green School Days uh, from Greece. 
So the amount of $5,000 goes to this concept idea to Greece. And we really hope that um, you know, this will make an impact to the ideas that they have presented. Then we go with the second one. Uh, Antonieta, we don't have any, uh, any applause or anything you know, to, to listen from, from the background, huh? Uh, um, <laughs> I would just want to congratulate uh, to the winners. Now the second one, go for it. Okay, so the second one is uh, Rakip Belishaku, the uh, Renora Handmade idea from Albania. So the second idea goes to Albania. Congratulations, Albania, this year. And this uh, concludes the concept ideas before we move on to the advanced ideas. I'm pretty sure this was a tough job for jurors also to decide because there were quite a lot of uh, good ideas both in both lots. But, you know, we have to uh, select uh, five out of all what you have applied. So uh, let's move on with um, the first one on the advanced ideas, which is uh, Lefteris Arapakis, uh, the Mediterranean cleanup from Greece. Again, Greece uh, hits first on this advanced lot. Congratulations to Greece for the second time this year. Uh, really happy with the ideas that you have presented. So um, then we go with the next one, which is uh, Sofia Deceva uh, from North Macedonia. Why is uh, additive from North Macedonia? Congratulations, Antoinette, as well. <laughs> Macedonia won again this year, so uh, very happy to see this. And the third and last one, uh, Branko Kursmanovic from Serbia, City and Me. Um, very nice platform, advanced, and really congratulations to, to the winners. So, um, Antonieta, I think my job and responsibility ends here. I'll, I'll return the floor to you as well with uh, more like details and, and whatever you have to, to yeah. respond. Congratulations, okay. guys. The winners. Congratulations from me. Thank you, Visar. I know we cannot bring the excitement being behind the screen. That's what I was missing, to be honest with you. You know, I miss that, you know, yelling and uh, applauds and, you know, screaming and all that kind of stuff. But uh, hey, uh, next year, we promise we're going to be together in person. Yeah, I really hope and we promise at least that we're going to have a hybrid event where we will have a couple of people in the room and the others can follow us online. I'm really happy for the selection of the winners. We have a very diverse group of countries. And also, I'm very happy that this year, beside the TAF job, the jurors really um, selected the best green ideas from the region. And for the next year, uh, we invite everyone who want and who are having some concept or green businesses or nonprofit organization to apply at the national competitions that will start hopefully in January 2021. For now, I would like to congratulate one more time for the national uh, foundations and for the winners we will share the information uh, to the media and I would like to uh, thank you all for this virtual event that was um, the only possible this year and uh, enjoy the day and uh, congratulations one more time from me so goodbye, goodbye.